history schools refer to different approaches or methodologies used in the study of interpretation of history these schools of thought often represent distinct perspectives on how history should be analyzed understood and written here are some prominent schools of history orientalist school this is a school of thought wherein west is patronizing the east culture cambridge school cambridge school is a school of thought which downplays ideology nationalist school nationalist school emphasizes the importance to congress and gandhi wherein hindu nationalists are for hindutva version marxist school this school of thought interprets history through the lens of class struggle emphasizing the role of economic factors and social classes in shaping historical events subaltern school subaltern school deals with caste conflict annals school originating in france in the early 20th century the annals school focuses on the long term historical structures and trends rather than individual events or personalities post colonial school post colonial historians examine the impact of colonialism and imperialism on societies cultures and identities feminist school Feminist historians analyze history through the lens of gender, focusing on the experiences and contributions of women. Whig school. The Whig interpretation of history presents the past as a progressive march towards greater liberty, democracy, and enlightenment. Cultural school. Cultural historians study the role of culture, ideas, beliefs, and symbols in shaping historical developments. Structuralist school. Structuralist historians analyze history by examining underlying structures and systems that influence human behavior. Cleometric school. Cleometricians use quantitative methods and statistical analysis to study historical data. These schools of thought are not mutually exclusive and historians often draw from multiple approaches depending on the context and subject of their research. Thank you.